segment is sponsored by Mount Pleasant Pet Magazine. We want, we all want the best care for our furry friends, right? And Pet Day with Mount Pleasant Magazine continues right now with advanced animal care. We have publisher Bill Mascio joining us with Dr. David E. Steele. Good morning to both of you. Good morning, morning Erin. You said bring in some sunshine. Yes, <laughs> yes. On this rainy day. You know, we're talking all things pets. Why did you want to bring the doctor today? You know, I was visiting uh, um, uh, Dr. Steele's office one day and uh, and we were talking and he told me about he has a kind of mission if you would sure uh, to um, uh, go at summer bees up because he's his office advanced animal care is located in North Mount Pleasant okay. and summer bees is up mm -hmm. there and some of those older folks can't get out and take right. the take the course the, the, the staff was teasing him because all the ladies like they uh, <laughs> the Dr. Steele <laughs> over there but I, I my heart you really touched my heart and I and I've been knowing you for a while. There's other things you do too, but that really did touch my heart. So sure. that's why I brought him on. That's great. I know he's very passionate about what he does. I can tell yeah. just in a few minutes talking to you. How long has your practice been around? Yeah. So uh, Leslie and I, my wife, we moved here to Mount Pleasant in '94, wow. and we opened up Advanced Animal Care of Mount Pleasant uh, 21 years ago this July. So we've been here for a long You've time. You've been here for a long time. Yeah. What is your overall passion and feeling with your practice? Yeah. So. In doing and in, in being practiced for as long as we have, uh, we've gotten to know a lot of people and a lot of amazing pets. And when you take the time to talk to them and listen, you learn a lot more about their needs that go beyond mm -hmm. just their pet care needs. Uh, and so we discovered that there were other things out there. For instance, like Summerbee, mm -hmm. a retirement facility, right? And those people there have a lot of challenges uh, that prevent them or get in the way of them being able to take care of their pets. Mm -hmm. It might be physical or emotional, cognitive, or maybe even just transportation. Sure. But that puts that relationship in jeopardy. And, and it, what a tragedy that would be. This is a time in their life when uh, they're losing a lot of their their privileges and responsibilities and having mm -hmm. that companion can be life-saving for them. So we saw a need and we just saw a way that we could fulfill that by going there. That's wonderful. Have you seen an influx in pets since the pandemic? I feel like everyone got like a COVID puppy. Yeah, so I, I <laughs> do think that having more that. time at home, mm -hmm. uh, people realize they had more opportunities to do that and bringing a pet in their families can be a, a very enriching and wonderful mm -hmm. thing, so yes. That's wonderful. Bill, when someone comes to town as what, 40, day, for, or 40 to 50 people a day at are least. moving here at least mm -hmm. daily, um, what's the best place? You know, you come here, you need a vet, you want someone known and trusted, you know, what do you have that can help people find that? Well, of course, we have the magazine, uh, Mount Pleasant Pets, but also if they go to mountpleasant.pet, mm -hmm. um, there is a veterinarian directory on there, and there's a groomer directory on there, and there's stores that help your pets. So kind of like yes, a one-stop shop. One-stop for shop everything. for everything. So it's mountpleasant.pet. Okay, and doctors, do you recommend, I imagine if someone's new to town, they just establish that relationship right away before we need medicine or someone's sick. Or yes, best thing to do is to go visit that vet office. Yeah. Find out how open are they to willing to talk with you and spend a little time mm -hmm. with you to teach you about your pet. Uh, the time that you last would want to find somebody is when you're under duress and in an emergency. Absolutely. Thank you for you're your time today. Such a pleasure to meet you, Bill. Don't go anywhere. You're still here. I'll be, I'll because be Mount hanging Pleasant out with you. Pet Day continues throughout the entire hour right here on Low Country Live. We're going to take a quick break. We've got more LCL right after this.